Why is a robust social safety net important? In my experience as a legislative assistant in Arjuni GRC, I often meet residents who seek help for financial assistance and job placement when they lose their jobs. Losing a job often means losing the income to support their family, and this can be extremely stressful. With the current COVID-19 situation, many Singaporeans are at the risk of losing their sources of livelihood. On the 28th of April 2020, the Monetary Authority of Singapore says that it is expecting more job losses, wage cuts, as the Singapore economy deals with the large erupt shock from COVID-19. It further highlighted that workers in retail, F&B, and recreational services are vulnerable to layoffs. While the Ministry of Manpower recommends employees pay retrenchment benefits to retrenched employees who have served the companies for at least two years, some companies may not be able to do so for various reasons. This means that these workers may suddenly be unable to cover their essential expenses. In the longer term, business restructuring across industries and other crises will be inevitable. Retrenchments are bound to happen in uncertain times. As such, financial support for our fellow workers to reach and transit through these tough times is essential. However, we cannot only rely on the employer paying the recommended retrenchment benefits. We cannot expect the government of the day to fund income shortfalls of retrenched citizens with past reserves. We at the Workers' Party believe that we should improve the social safety net, sustainability for the rainy days that is yet to come. Therefore, the Workers' Party worked on our proposal for redundancy insurance, or RI. It is aimed at protecting Singaporeans and ensure that they have the means to support themselves in their time of need. How does a RI work then? Workers and employers will contribute to a centrally pool fund. In the event that someone is retrenched, a payout will be made from this pool. We propose that each Singaporean contribute by 1% equivalent of the median income of Singaporeans, which is about $4.50 a month. A retrenched person may claim up to 40% of his or her last drum pay. For lower income Singaporeans, we have set aside a minimum payout of $500 so that they have sufficient funds to tie over such a harrowing period. The RI proposal is a supplementary policy meant to work hand in hand with the current programs to help our fellow workers tie through tough times while getting themselves prepared for future employment. We presented our policy in Parliament in May 2017, but was rejected. However, we at the Workers' Party believe that RIs is sensible, reasonable, and affordable. It deserves further consideration by Parliament. With your support, we will push this policy proposal in Parliament. Vote for the Workers' Party.